Hello, my name is Dr. Michelle Maidenberg. Today we're going to be doing a inner child guided meditation. So we all have points in our childhood when we have difficult memories. It could be from, you know, more traumatic ones to less traumatic ones. But those memories typically, you know, really get lodged in our neural networks. And we take them with us into our adulthood. It's really, really always important, you know, when you're getting activated or something's really wounding or raw, to think back, like, what is this rubbing up against for me? Right? Like, and it's the same sensations. It could be bodily sensations in our bodies, you know, that's evoking us, or it could be, you know, a feeling. Um, whether it's sadness or anger or frustration, um, you know, we, we make these natural associations between these very visceral feelings. And sometimes they, they're dated back to the past and they become so much more exacerbated because of our experiences in the past. So it's really helpful if you have these memories to process them, to work through them. And doing some, you know, specific work around our inner child really helps with that. Sometimes we don't even know what's deep down below in our unconscious or our subconscious. So if you could sit up straight and if you feel comfortable enough, you could close your eyes. And again, we're going to do a quiet guided meditation today, really focusing on these memories. So if you could slowly close your eyes and become aware of your breath. And very intentionally take slow, deep breaths, inhaling and exhaling very gently. As you're breathing in, on the out breath, you're releasing any tension, allowing the breath to help you relax the muscles, anything you've been holding. Breathing in slowly and gently out. And we're going to go through the process of beginning and working on connecting with this inner child. And as we're talking about the inner child, just naturally see what comes to the surface. It could be a certain period of time that you remember. And have an image in your mind of yourself as that child. What did you look like? How did you feel? What was going on for you during that time? And as you see that child, think about the emotions it evokes. And imagine looking into that child's eyes, really noticing and seeing that child. Was that child experiencing pain, frustration, confusion, sadness, anxiousness? What was, what was coming up? 
and think about why. What caused that to be the case during that moment in time? And through your eyes, let the child know that you're there. Let your inner child know that you're here to see them, to validate their feelings, to have respect for where they're at, for having compassion for what they're going through. And just allow whatever scenes and images and memories surface, just allow them to unfold and to be. And notice if it's coming up anywhere in your body. Sometimes shows up in our heart in our abdomen, wherever it shows up. Again, without judgment, just allow it to be. And allow either your adult self or your child to display that emotion, to have this safe space, to allow both of you to just be. Now allow any energy that comes in the room to be present, to fortifying security and safety and care right here, right now. And if strong emotions surface, Again, focus on that breath, breathing in and out. And visualize holding that child's hand. And place your left hand in your inner child's hand and your right hand on your inner child's upper arm. Holding their hand and they're turning their shoulder in your arm. And expressing whatever words of comfort, whether it's, you'll be okay, this is temporary, we will grow through this journey. You are loved and cherished. And think about if you want to take this younger self with you. Or maybe leave your younger self in peace and calmness, recognizing that the years have passed and you have evolved. Or maybe there's more nurturing to be had and you 
want to continue to nurture that younger self. There's no right or wrong way. And visualize that younger self growing up. becoming evolved and thriving and time passing and come back to who you are today with all of your life experience and being more in tune with who you are and the life you want to live and your perpetual growth And feel your feet strongly planted on the ground as your adult self, strong and resilient, brave, rooted like a tree, that you could have life circumstances come and go, but you are always foundationally strong, rooted in the ground. And take one last breath, breathing in gently. Breathing out any tension you must be sitting with. And again, just feel the air vacillating, releasing any tension that your body's holding on to. And when I count to three and when you're ready, you could open your eyes. One, two, and three. Thank you. I believe in you wholeheartedly and unconditionally.